Hello, Monsters of Bound here, and welcome to part 14 of my Skaven campaign with Queek. Queek, of course, where, where is Queek? Is that, is that Queek? There he is. More trophies. Yes, yes. Yeah, it's Queek. Queek, a, a rat who is is as high as stature as, as as famous rats such as um, Roland Rat, Rassigan from Basil the Great Mouse Detective, the rat from Ratatouille. Can't remember his name. Uh, Splinter. Well, Splinter was actually more a human that mutated into a rat, wasn't he? So that's. Does that count? He was. And he was. He was bigger than a normal rat. Rats of unusual size, maybe. Well, either way, Queek's definitely the stature of all of those and potentially more. Um, we were going to deal with the the last defenders because they've been a bit of a pain in our side for a while and then I want to deal with the elves because they've been even worse frankly. Um, they're probably my, the, my nemesis are these guys right over here. So we need to do we need to put them out of out of our misery and uh, Remamute, Rem, Remamute, yeah Remamute is he's over here uh, raiding that that's very good. Here is um, I'm going to rename actually Mechingear. He's going to be It's going to be Capen, Capen Mechingear, the pirate. That kind of works. Yeah, that would. Yeah, there, there we go. Captain Mechingear, the the pirate. Fantastic. Uh, he's going after lost treasure with his his pirate crew, all Skaven slaves. There, that's fantastic stuff. We've got Slatland. Slatland is under our control, and I, what I wanted to do is build some um, a gem mine shaft. Because that'll that'll produce some gems. We can sell those to um, Skrolk over in Lustria. He'll love those for some reason. Oh, he loves to to bling himself up. He does. Nice little bit, little little bit of body glitter when he's going out on a Friday night. It's uh, it's all good. He can't he can't see it obviously because he's blind, but um, he he loves to look fabulous. Um, so that's that's pretty good. So we've got a Lord not moved. Where's that Remu? Well, we don't care about that. We've got a damaged building. Where's that? Oh yes, yes, the Serpent Coast, which came under attack by the Elves, but Scar chased them off. Good job, Scar. Who else? Nerglost. Nerglost is. Uh... Wait, where is Nerg? Nerglost? Oh, you are. Oh, there you are. I thought you were. A... I thought you were a Saurus. Um, can you assassinate that guy? You can't. That's okay. Why not join? Remember mute. Yep, maybe you can hit uh, that town later. We'll do that. That's fine. We'll go with that for the moment. It's all good. Let's uh, sp speed that up. Eh, I don't really bother. Uh, what did that? What did, did you just move over there, or did you do something? I think you just moved over there. I think we're well on our way. Uh, we might be able to. Do the next ritual soon. Uh, we could do the ritual. Um, so Lotharan and Yavresi have uh, confederated. That's that's fine. Do we want to continue to? Let's right, Queek. You're going to go and take Nahontal. Go and grab that one. Yeah, that's going to be an easy win for you. Good job. Nicely done. Uh, we're actually doing okay for food for once, so uh, that's quite nice. Let's loot and occupy. And let's... Remember, you, you can move into uh, Statues of the Gods. Continue to raid a little bit there. That'll be very nice. We've got another settlement in the Red Rivers. Um region. Oh, we could get we could get wood. Do you like a good bit of wood? Do you like some wood? Wood's always good. Um, Scar, can you go and chase down this guy? Because uh, he, he's been a bit of a pain. Can we... Uh, an ambush? Let's just wipe him out. There we go. Nicely done. Let's take the food because, you know what? Food? We're actually doing pretty well for... F really? 15 from food? Hang on a sec. Uh, right, Pet Wolf, Executioner, good job. Yeah, 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 whatever. Right, what the hell is going on? Right, one food generated there. Where is all this food coming from? That's what I'm nervous about. I do have some mods installed, but I didn't think they were that powerful. Ah, docks generate f food. Is that the mod, or...? 
15 food from buildings. How do I feel about that? That seems a bit overpowered. Hmm. Might have to look at me mods. Three food from... So where is all this food coming from? That's what I want to know. Um... So we're getting food from... Okay, I guess we do have some docks, don't we? So, well, not that many, actually. Interesting. I'm not sure where that's all coming from. I might have to look that over um, after I finish the episode. Just make sure that it's not... Um, not really, really silly, because I... I I like the food mechanic, I just felt it was a bit punishing to start off with for Queek um, because you didn't have the pastures nearby. Um, I know people have said that you should really be using the uh, the exploitative planning. It does reduce your tax rate but you do... was it someone said? Yeah, so you have this ravenous expansion ability which is income from settlements can be boosted up to 40% for all regions. So one warlord with that basically nullifies and you get 10% additional um, that exploitative planning, which is interesting. Um, I'm not sure... It, mm, it, it kind of feels like unless you know how to deal with food, you're going to have real trouble with it. And I guess maybe that's a learning thing, but it, it feels a bit unintuitive, is, is I think what, is what I'm trying to get at. It doesn't feel very um, very natural. Okay, Meta Storm. You've got a skill point. Ballistics Calibration. Ooh, that's, yes, we'll go for Ballistics Calibration. Go for that. And I think next we're going to get uh, Qxital. And our cities over here are absolutely fine. Yeah, Public Order's good. Public order's falling here. We probably need to deal with that somehow. Not sure really. We'll, we'll sort that out. Uh, if I do the ritual, it'll be Quick's home, Torsa Pinder, and Quick's bar. Right, so the, these settlements down here. That's fine as long as chaos come from um, the east or west. Because they come from the north, they'll have to go through a lot of settlements before they reach it, and they will basically raise everything in their path. So that's something to just keep in mind before we do that. Oh, Mechengear, Captain Mechengear, I forgot about you, but you have found a sunken treasure ship. Good job. Top pirating. Pirating. A true water rat is Mechengear. He knows how to splice a main brace and how to quaff rum, I think, maybe, I don't know. Is that what pirates do? Okay. Good. Um. Okay, that's fine. Oh, so they've stolen technology from us. That's fine. Top knots have been destroyed. That's fine, I guess. I'm not really bothered. Uh, let's go for Qoxital. We do have a small army there, but that should be no problem. Uh, let's upgrade our gem mine. That seems like a good plan. And our lair. There we go. That'll be fine. And can do we send Scar to join up? Or I mean, the elves could attack at any time. Maybe we just need to hold off. Uh, right. Is there anything? Oh, there's lots of. Oh yes, we're going over here. Yep. Sail CC. Off you go, Captain. Captain. Oh. No, you don't. You love it. You love water. You just... Oh, it's, it's like my cat. She loves water. And by that means she meows pitifully whenever I put it near her. Um, let's go for Musk of Fear. As the law of ruin siphons the winds of magic and unholy despair takes hold and service dwellers, the rats lurk in the shadows. Ooh, chilling stuff. Truly chilling stuff. Right, Queek, you're over there. That's fine. We're raiding a little bit. That's good. Um... Yep, that's all fine. Lord not moved. Scar, yeah, I... 
think what I'm going to do is I'm going to send you back to Serpent Coast just because. Don't trust the elves. Um, we've got wolves there already. Um, we could go from a. That would give us food. Maybe I'll hold off. Remember, you, you haven't moved, but you're raiding. So you're bringing us some food in. Yep, he really is. Uh, you want a peace treaty? No, absolutely not. The only peace you're going to get is the peace of the grave, because I'm going to put you put you in it. I don't know what the lizard men's burial sort of things are. The not techniques. Forgotten the word. You listen to quick, yes, yes. I have the best words. You have the best words. <laughs> um, you want to not? I'm not going to sign in on aggression pack because I might want to kill you later. In fact, I'm definitely going to want to kill you later. Uh, they've tried to block us and failed. They've stolen technology. That's fine. Let's go and take this city. This should be fairly easy. Yes, it's going to be pretty easy. There we go. An easy win, and we will loot and occupy. Excellent. Red Rivers is secure. So let's go for construction, uh, cost reduction and growth. I kind of want to continue my war on the dwarves, but maybe not just yet. Uh, oh yes. Mechan gear. Bop. So we got... Where is it? Horde of the Admiral. Yeah, so there we go. So we've got a Sword of Striking and 10,000 cash. And this is the Horde of the Vampire Admiral. There's another Horde of the Vampire. He left out. He had a lot of hordes. He had a lot of... A lot of skull-shaped islands in the middle of the sea, he found. Pretty much must have spent all his time just finding them. And uh, putting stuff in there. Uh, Sin Surge, you've got a skill point. Let's pop that in precise. More damage is more good. And... Caracas... Let's go for... Ooh, um, I mean, Vermintide is pretty good. Vermintide it is. Vermintide it is. There we go. So, um, there are more cities up here. One of them is owned by a different lizard man faction. Talqua. They have quite a large city with a big garrison, so we're probably going to have to... Uh, be a little bit cautious about taking them. I would like to take the wood elves out just because I think they're going to be a pain um, you know elves in general pretty much my worst nightmare um, we do have a lot of cash the cursed jungle we could build walls there I think we're going to do that let's upgrade the lair there um, what about over in Queek home we could build up the defences and that might be quite a good idea it is always probably going to be I think it will always be our um, one of our sites for our rituals. So beefing up the defences there is probably a good idea. What else do we have? Ah, Tower of Avenue Gold. Um, let's upgrade that. Because then we can upgrade the Warp Lightning Capacitors. Get more cash coming in there. That would be very good. And I think... Let's go for Assassin's Hideout there, and we'll go for the Clan Barracks. And we've got... Um, maybe we go for the Weapon bar uh, Burrow next turn. I think maybe turning this into a... Turn the Red Rivers into a settlement to recruit armies in... Oh, hello. The Wood Elves have got Antok as well. They've expanded. Yeah, I think turning this into a, a, a recruitment province would probably be a good idea because it's quite central to our what will be our empire and it will help us push northward into the vampire land. So I think that's probably something to keep in mind. Um, so maybe we want to get a rubbish pit for reduction in recruitment and also um, additional recruitment capacity. I think we're going to go for it. Yep. And yes, we're going to be continuing to raid there. That's all fine. Speak, 
speak. Be quick or I take your eyes with my tail. That, there you go. Peace treaty. No, absolutely not. You, you, you wounded si oh, poor Sin Surge. You spent more time in the infirmary than I think any other character. Just keeps getting knocked out by lizardmen. Right, once we've taken out the lizard men, I think what we're going to do is take out the wood elves and then take out the elves Toralisa to the to the east. So you managed to wound him, you've stolen more tech. God damn it. And we're going to march on the statues of the gods. Can we re I think we can reach it next turn. So that should be fine. Um Scar, you've got a skill point. Let's... What do I think would be... Um, you are quite a beefy character. Yeah, I mean, more weapon damage I think would probably be quite good. You are quite beefy. And you've got a rat ogre to, to ride around on, so that's pretty... That's pretty good. Uh, Mechan gear over here. Watch out for that whirlpool, be careful. Let's go and grab the shipwreck over here. So we've got the Risen Isle, uh, blah, 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 yeah, whatever. Uh, materials at sea, plus income and minus construction cost for all buildings for six turns and a weapon of might. Excellent. And uh, let's go and grab that one. Careful, as I say, careful of the whirlpool. Just, you know, just keep it in mind. And we'll get 10,000 of more cash next turn. Captain Mechingear, real, I mean, you know, what, oh, my, the elves. The elves are back. Come on. Scar, we need to get, yeah, march, march, hurry on. Come on. Get down here, you'll be fine. It's just a small force this time. Uh, remember you, yeah, well, you're you're raiding for us, so that's that's what you're going to be doing. I don't think that's... Do we... What can, what can we recruit here? Pretty much bugger all slaves. Um, maybe more slaves would be a... Maybe more slaves would be a good thing. Uh, I'll pop over here. That'll heal you up and you could recruit more units. Um, would that be a good idea? More artillery maybe? We do have quite a... That's going to take four turns though, that's such a long time. Um, could get Skaven Slave Slingers. Just more slaves. Uh, basically, we're going to want to take Talqua. And that's going to be a tough battle. There's a lot of Temple Guard there. So we're probably going to need... Hmm. If we're going to... If we're going to siege a city, which we'll have to do, do I want more... Do I want more storm vermin? Or do I... Maybe I want more artillery. Artillery is pretty brutal. Yeah, okay, we'll go for artillery. So we can get two units of artillery. It's going to cost a fair chunk because we're recruiting them from the global pool and four turns. So that's, that's quite a while, but it will give us time to grab the statue to the god. Maybe even resettle. Where is the third city? Death Heads a Monolith. I don't know whether. I think it might be over here somewhere. Um, but that'll let us grab those settlements. And then we can bring in the artillery. And Scar can go and deal with these guys. Oh, those bloody elves. Treaty deal, you seek, seek. Uh, Blood Hall co Covenant. You want a trade agreement? Yeah, sure. 
that's fine. Come, Skaven, join us. Together we will watch the world burn. You're friendly. Why are you friendly? Uh, oh, apparently you don't like Zlatlan for some godforsaken reason. Or Toralesa. Well, I don't like Toralesa either, so uh, yes, you have yourself a deal, Dark Elves. A rejection would have meant your life, would it now? So nice little trade agreement there. We'll bring us in a little bit more cash. Uh, looks like the last defenders have negotiated peace with the Necratchet Brotherhood and opposing ritual has been completed. We are catching up with them now, which is good. Um, you want us to raid the Tower of Stars again. You really want us... Yeah, Sneak, you really want us to raid that, but we're, you know, we're, we're a bit busy. Just, um, wh wh where are you going? Never. Scar, follow them. I want to know where they go. Uh, oh, yes. I can get you going grab that for us. Boop. Good stuff. We've got Gold Sigil Sword. It's another horde of the Vampire Admiral. Gold Sigil Sword and 10,000 gold. Very, very nice. Um, is there anything else around here we can grab? It's all pretty deserted, actually. We've, we've grabbed a, a lot of stuff. Maybe we need to come back towards our coast now. Uh, maybe grab that one. It's going to be a long old sail um, across the southern southern straits of the Great Ocean. Is that right? Yep, southern straits of the Great Ocean. That's what it is. It's going to be a long old sail, but I'm sure I'm sure you're up to the task. And Meta Storm has got another skill point. Good stuff. I know. I totally want a Doom Rocket. I don't know what it is, but it sounds amazing. So let's get the Doom Rocket, and we're going to attack the statues of the gods. So this is, I think, the last settlement of the. Last defenders. And uh, I kind of want to turn up. Do I test out my death? Nah, I do. Well, mm. no, I'll, I'll just auto resolve it. We're going to have a big battle coming up anyway. So uh, it'll, it'll be fine. Let's bring in a little bit of food. That's going to be very nice. And we will loot and occupy. A potion of healing for that. Statue of the Gods. Anything interesting we can build here? Nope. No, we can't actually build statues of the gods. They are just apparently there. Right, we do have a lot of cash. We've actually got quite a lot of cash coming in. It's quite nice. Uh, Nurgloss the Insane has got a skill point. Let's put that in precise. And is there anything that takes three turns to recruit or less? That would be quite nice to have. Um... Could get some gutter runner slingers. Could get some plague monks. Yeah, let's get some. Yeah, get some plague monks. In the, uh, oh, it's going to take four turns. Okay, drop out. That's fine. Just go for Quick. for three turns. That'll be fine. Death heads monolith is over there, so we can grab that. And Talqua has got some pastures as well, so that's going to be very useful. And Let's upgrade. Let's get some more wood. Let's get some more walls. Let's upgrade. Oh, are you heading for unprotected settlements? Well, we don't really have any. I mean, not on the coast. Stupid elves. Okay, that's that's fine. That's fine. I'm a little bit concerned. I don't know where those elves are going. That guy's just been wandering around stealing our stuff. He's he's light fingered. Do the last defenders have another settlement? Uh, oh, it's you guys. You yeah, you declared war on us, didn't you? You want a peace treaty? Um, sure, but give me some give me some money. No, I want more than five hundred, mate. Let's go for that much. There we go. Um, Ursharan. What do you want? A trade agreement? Uh, yeah, sure. I could use more money at the moment. 
I can always kill you later. Okay, let's declare war. Yeah, we'll call Clan Pestilence, may as well. And uh, we will lay siege. Let's uh, get some towers in the mix. Very nice, very good. And we just need to wait two more turns for some defenses, uh, for some, for our Dubibot 6 uh, catapults. That's the word I was looking for. I can get you're gonna you're gonna have a little bit of a rough trip over the sea. I'm just warning you now. And uh, these elves appear to be wandering around. They got a star dragon. Ugh. That doesn't sound particularly particularly fun. Uh, do right. Where right, where are the right last defender? You you still got one settlement. Oh, over there. Right, right in the middle of all of the under. Have you got the you got the pillars? You got the oh, you've got the um, black pyramid of Nagash under your control. Interesting. Okay, that's. I mean, it's not good, but it's a thing. Let's get the golden tower of the gods because that generates income, public order, research, and income from all buildings in the region. That's gonna be amazing. That's gonna be absolutely fantastic. Totally having that. Uh, we've already got. Oh, we're getting the wood anyway, so that's fine. Let's get the walls then. Always build walls. Where are those elves going? You're going to steal more tech? Yes, you are. It's basically, all you're doing. Just running around stealing my stuff. Okay. You're going all... Where, where the hell are you going? That's just... Uh, you know what, Scar? Give up the chase. There's no point. I don't know where these... Are they going for Slatlin? What's the defense... What? Defenses in Slatlin. What are they like? Um, pretty... Yeah, that's piss poor, to be honest. But um, one turn, and we will be ready with catapults there. Uh, oh, Beckon Gear. There's a Sea Corpse. Boop. Another 500 cash. That's very nice. Uh, see if you can. Yeah, just. It's going to be. You're, it's a, is it a little bit choppy out there? It looks a bit choppy. A little bit. A little bit bumpy. That's fine. Just, you know, hold on. Just batten down the hatches or brace the main, main brace or drink, drink some rum or. Get a peg leg or so I don't know. Do some, you know, do something piratey. It's fine. Be absolutely fine. Not a problem. Uh, so let's grab that, and I think. Uh, do we get the medicinal herbs? Another food? Uh, yeah, I, th I think that's worth worth the effort. And let's get some walls there, and uh, another lair would probably be quite good, and all that kind of good stuff. I'm a little bit. A little bit concerned about these elves. The army's not particularly big, but it does have some beefy units in it. Do we got um, it's one more turn? So let's grab some more uh, spears. Yep, yeah, slave spears. Do that. We do need to help Queek because he can't take on that entire garrison by himself. If oh, maybe we should have sent Scar to assist. Oh, it's a bit late now. Never mind. Do... No, I'm going to hold off. I was thinking about getting another army, but... Um, I think that might be a little bit... A little bit too soon. They're heading for... Z Z really? Why are you heading over there?
Sin Surge is ready for duty. That's good. Uh, we could head down and I guess we're going to have to head down and assist because if they land, I don't think Zlatan will be able to hold up against the Star Dragon by itself. Um, Remember, you, you've got a skill point, and I think um, what what do I think? I think we're going to go for <sighs> Muscafear there, and Krakus is going to go. For for Warpstone tokens, a little bit of extra magic coming in. A little bit concerned about Queek, he's out there by himself and that army is, is pretty big. So we have to be a little bit, a little bit care- oh there's more el more elves. It was a, it was a faint. They're attacking Serpent Coast. Scar, get over there. Oh, they're gonna take Serpent- oh my god, they got Phoenix Scar galore in there. Come on Scar, hurry up. I know you've been running up and down, but um... You're needed. I need to deal with those elves. They're just the worst. Uh, can we assassinate this guy? 42% chance. Boop. Critical success. Good job, Sin Surge. Nice work. Let's give that into assassinate. Put a point in there. And Remimute. Uh, go, go for that one. Uh, not Remimute. Captain, Captain Mechangear the pirate. Gonna go and head over towards the elven ruins over here. I mean, we might just be able to siege it down until they run out of food, but um. Bow to Quick, make musk of fear. Yes, yes. You know what? If you want a peace treaty, fine. Because we're not going to be able to get to you anyway. You're surrounded by potential enemies that don't like you very much. And yeah, we're gonna lose serpent. Okay, what? Are, they've got dragon princes. They've got star dragons. They've got my. How many phoenix? Jesus Christ! Oh my. Uh, yeah. Well, um, Scar, you, you're gonna have. You're gonna be in for a little battle there. Uh, okay, they're attacking. How do I? I mean, how how do I feel about this battle? That is a lot of blessed units they've got. I, I'm going to run away. Scurry away. Yeah, that's right. Scurry away. Um, got fortunate for Scar. Mission fate. Well, yeah. Um, maybe can we can we maybe lure them out? If if quick, if you go over here and ambush. See if you can't pull... Where are those... Are, wait, are you heading for Captain Mechingear? Have you, see, have you seen him? And have you heard exploits of him sailing around? You've decided that um, he needs to be put out. Um, he needs to be sunk. Uh, well, bar let's get barrels of rum. And uh, let's go for... No, don't, don't sail over the, the whirlpool. I think they're going for Captain Mechingear. I think I think they think they can kill him. Oh, you little you little nightmares! Um, right, let's let's move up. I'm going to be a little bit cautious, and I'm going to ambush because that army is is pretty terrifying. It's huge. Temple Avenue of Gold. Yes, we're going to upgrade there. Um, I mean, I would like... Let's go for the, the public order. And... Maybe go for another Warlock Engineer. I think. Do that. And what about here? Um, let's go for the Clan... Hits. Yeah, let's do that. Let the bell scream, scream. Uh, Meta Storm, you've got a skill point, and I mean we've got the Doom Rocket there. We've got our t range for artillery. That might be quite nice. Speed for artillery, speed for missile infantry units. That might be quite nice. 
Um, maybe some spells would be good. So maybe we want to go for... Um, mind you, augmented weapon. Arms I mean, ammunition is good. Yeah, arms dealer it is. Ammunition. Uh, the fact that the Warlock Engineers sell all to all sides in the constant scheme and struggle for dominance is well known. The fact that for a very high price they offer to withhold their services is widely guessed. Indeed. Okay, I'm going to hopefully lure those out. That army is 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 potent. Scars has some slaves in it, so not so good. I'm I'm hoping that we can win through the fact that we've got all the the um, uses of menace below, so we can pick out their archers and their eagle claw. But they've got a star dragon and so many phoenix guard. Those guys just do not die. So uh, that's something to keep in mind. Uh, can we assault you? That's probably not going to work, actually. Skaven corruption is going up. Uh, we'll just hold off there for the moment, I think. And that should be fine. So the last defenders have... Did they declare war? On the undead? I think they did. Jeez, that's that's brave. You've got to give it to Krokkar. He is psychotic. You listen to Queek, yes, yes. I have the best words. Uh, non-aggression pack, no. Ah, uh, Talqua are moving on. Quoxottle, by the looks of it. But we could... We could assault. Let's try assaulting the units. You slow things and make them slower. We have succeeded. It doesn't seem to do any damage, but that's okay. We're going to move. Uh, I'll tell you what, we can. Let's lay siege. Remember, mute. You're going to. It's fine. Mute. You're going to back us up, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to attack this turn. Time for things to die, die. Die, die. We will wait until next turn, so that you're not tired out. But I don't think we'll need the siege engines, even if they take Quoxital. That's not going to be the end of the world. Oh, they've got their bloody garrison back, haven't they? Shoot. Okay, but we're going to have. To attack Serpent Coast and wipe out those... Oh my god, there's another army. Misguided. Oh, those elves are the worst... I so have to do... Oh, they're just... I... I really think this faction is too powerful. The fact that they can throw... Stacks and stacks at me on hard... I mean, that that is too... Can... Yeah, I, 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 I think they get too much cash. They, I think they're... I think the number of ports on that faction, including all the trade goods and the bonuses they get for the El I think they get the yeah, Elven Colony, is is just too much. They they have too much money to spare, so they just they can just throw stacks and stacks at you. I think on very hard. I I would be I would be interested to see if anyone can win on that. I, I wonder if there's any let's plays where they, they play like legendary or very hard Queek. That would be interesting to see how they deal with Tor or Lesser. Um, but yeah, uh, but I'm going to have to leave it to there for the moment because we are reaching uh, almost 40 minutes of the let's play so we're going to leave it there and uh, next next episode we'll have to see if we can take on the serpent coast and uh, talqua as well so lots of battles there were no battles this episode but there's going to be lots of battles next that's a potential promise so there we go so thank you very much for watching and i'll see you next time